So after my uh, brother got out of the uh, military, he decided to join the police department. Man, your brother used to be really cool. Yeah, he had dreadlocks and everything. He had a car. <laughs> well, he still has a car. It's just not quite the same kind of car that, you know, you used to. So, you know. But do you think you can use his legal mojo to get us out of a sticky situation? What? We need your help. Oh. Oh, jeez. I don't know what you guys got yourselves into, but I think I should actually call my brother. I think we're going to need a lawyer. Oh, no, no, don't worry about it. <clears throat> All right. Hey, Howie, how are you doing over there? Oh, it's your it's brother. I don't have a brother. Pat. It's your brother, Pat. Don't you recognize my voice? I know it's over the phone. It's kind of filtered, but... Wait a minute, Pat. Is that really you? I haven't heard from you in, like, over three hours. How are you doing? Uh, I, I'm fine. Um, well, this is a police line. You should probably make it quick. Oh, oh, yeah, I need your help. I don't sell anymore. You know that. Oh, I, I miss those old good old days of back in the day where you and your friends would come over and we'd hang out in the basement. This is a police matter, Howie. My friends are in deep. They need as much help as they can get. I, I hope you can advocate for them for maybe a lighter sentence or anything. Well, that is beyond my uh, jurisdiction. I'm not sure. Perhaps maybe you tell me what they did and I could probably help them. But Listen, Howie, I know we've been through a lot. And they should probably get a lawyer. We're college students. We can't afford a lawyer. What are you, crazy? Sorry. I'll see what I can do. Now listen closely. Uh-huh. All right. Thanks. Ugh. Well, what was it? You guys better get a lawyer. I'm telling you what. <laughs> you think this is some kind of joke? This is your future. Oh, Pat, don't over-exaggerate. <sighs> Maybe you're right. Maybe I am exaggerating. <laughs> That's the Pat we know. Let's ignore our problems just like the U.S. government. You know, this government was built on justice, law and order, and defending what's yours. And... If you guys wouldn't mind, I'd like to uh, bring my camera and so oh, I can fun. document your guys' arrest, your struggle, and some of the court proceedings and therefore after. Shall we then? Okay, okay. Our car is over here. Huh, nice car. My, my daddy bought it for me. Why? When I graduated from high school. Oh, okay. Were, were you an honor student? <laughs> no. Hey, uh, by the way, where'd you get those pajamas? Internet. Most people get it from the internet. Ugh. Come on now. Hey, Pat, can you get in the driver's seat? We're going to have to push you to start it. Well, maybe we should just call the police to help us out. What the heck is wrong with you? We, they're not just some kind of maid service. Well, they don't seem to mind talking to me. Ugh. Oh, come on. You like hanging out with us. I will never admit to anything. Good day, sir. Okay, okay. Right, let's get out of here. Oh, please. Yes. Let's get on going. Let's go find this body that you guys left on the road. Jeez, why don't you just call the police and just tell them? <laughs> Does this remind you of our first date? I'll never forget it. I wish I could forget it. This is some horror movie BS. Okay, what you're going to want to do is you're going to have to uh, release the I, clutch. I know and, what I'm uh, doing. Turn the key. Okay, here we go. I've. All right, I'm guys. Crappy cars, make sure okay, you guys. buckle up. What have you gotten me into? We can't just leave a dead deer on the side of a road. It's not uh, right. A dead deer? This oh. Is... What do you think it was? Uh, a dead human? <laughs> yeah, right.